Hi, how are you? It's Travis here, and welcome back to our adventures in Azeroth. Last episode, we slayed Mad Jonah Sterling, which means the Alliance and Horde will no longer have to worry about pirate attacks. And we also recovered all of the lost Vikrul artifacts, so I believe today we will be bringing those back. Oh, Return to resting. My attention. Orvis hands you a satchel. Within this satchel are the artifacts that you recovered. Locate the burial mounds of Shield Hill, far to the southeast, where the items were originally stolen from, and return the artifacts. It is my hope that this gesture will quell the spirits that now haunt our hunting grounds. Be strong, Travis. Boron food. All right, let's bring these back. Hopefully, this will bring peace to the Tuscar. Because it seems like this land is now cursed. Who's this guy? Storm Giant. 189k health. I don't think we would be able to defeat him. I wonder if we can hit him with, uh... <laughs> with Frost Nova. I doubt it. Probably get one shot. Do you think we can take a hit from him? We'll try. I'll do it for fun. We'll do it when he's away from the of these uh, shovel toss. These shovel toss are pretty fast. Okay, so we'll do do this. We'll go like this. Didn't do anything. It's gonna chase us, right? Yeah, it's gonna kill us. <laughs> oh, he's going back. And this guy has an, an ability that like drops like, storm under. Under you? Run! Oh my gosh, dude. Look at those antler horns. This is brutal. V. Oh. No! <laughs> okay, well, that's what happens when you fight the storm giant. At least we tried to get away. We couldn't even get away so fast probably how it feels when you have like a grizzly bear chasing you down and you're like actually trying to run away just feel helpless I wonder if uh yeah cold snap only re resets frost spells it wouldn't have got us blink again and our pet couldn't get aggro. Well, I guess our pet just got destroyed. That's my guess. Got completely wrecked. By the storm chat. Alright, off to Shield Hill we go. I think it's just over here. And I think after that we'll hearth back to Kamigua. It's kind of far from the Ancient Lift, I think. I don't know. Probably not. Let's see if we get a mining level here. We got a huge citrine. Nice. Actually, use that as a gem for for one of our gear. We'd have to get it crafted, though. There's probably some JCs in Dalaran we could talk to. That's one thing I need to do is get a portal to JC. I mean, a portal to Dalaran. <laughs> All right, so here we are back at Shield Hill once again. So let's deliver these artifacts.
I didn't know you can cannibalize a shade. It's like a spirit. <laughs> it's kind of interesting. Here, let's group up a couple here. Get this one too. Gotta watch out though. These guys do have ranged abilities. Should have got that one. I think we might end up pulling him. We have ran out of mana. We have mana here though. Here we go. to make some food. Now, did he say anything? Your offering has come too late, little one. Can you feel the mist closing in upon you? The Kivaldir return. From the mist and fog, the Kivaldir approach. Flee while you still breathe the air of the living. So I guess the curse cannot be unbroken. So what we're doing right now doesn't really help at all. We already desecrated the grave. Well, we didn't. The pirates did, so. That pretty much ends it. Who's Korf? Isildolf's companion? Is that Isildolf? I didn't notice that guy the last time we were here. Isildolf Iceheart laughs. Look to the seas as your doom comes with the swell of the tides. Let's see if we pulled any. No? All right, here we go. The final artifact returned here. My brothers have awoken. Your efforts are wasted. Well, that's it. Looks like that did nothing at all. Well, that's too bad. It's going to be bad news for the Tuscar. First they had to deal with pirates, and now they're going to have to deal with the Vicruel. Grim tidings, Travis. My people are in danger and must be warned. These sea-faring aberrations will take no mercy upon the Kalawag. Good hunting. Return to Elder Atuik at Kamagua. He and the rest of my people must be warned of this impending doom that approaches from the sea. Orphus shivers. Use the ancient lift to reach him. Please hurry. 
Looks like we're gonna get a trinket from this, nice. Travel the wastes with care. Alright, so this is probably gonna be. Yeah, our final quest, and then we're gonna be off to the next zone, which I believe is gonna be Dragon Blight. I like this zone. Great zone. Dragon Blade's pretty good too. I like the music in Dragon Blade. They did well with pretty much the, I think the music in pretty much all the zones. This is the best expansion I think that probably ever came out. For World of Warcraft. There's some other good ones. Legion was pretty good. I enjoyed that one a lot. And Dragon Flight has been good, even though I haven't played too much, but I've heard good things. Let us visit for a while. Kalawak, thank you for all that you have done, Travis. We must now prepare for battle and warn our brothers and sisters across the sea of what is to come. I hope it is not too late. All right, so we got another trinket here. This will probably replace... I don't know. 43 haste and more spell power. Yeah, this will probably replace the infused uh, cold stone rune. Is it again when you can. So I'll put that on... And there we go. That trinket was a good one. And we'll have to uh, change our macro quick. And I think I should cast Ice Lance. It's Ice Lance rank one. Yeah, that's all I have is rank one Ice Lance. I don't have another rank of it. Probably go to the... Probably go to um, the skill trainer soon. There we go. Oops, what the heck? There we go. Hopefully that works. I switched it up so it casts Ice Lance first instead of proccing the trinket. I think that's better. You have my attention. Okay, we actually have another quest here. Many changes come to the land and water. You, them, much change. Kamigua's way of life is threatened by these changes. What will you do? Good hunting. The way to his heart. The North Sea Pirates slaughtered the Isles Alpha Sea Lion Bull, Big Roy. That was us. <laughs> they made soap from him to clean the decks of their ships. Anuniac size. Now the sea lions won't mate. Help me to repopulate their numbers. The reef bulls can be found at the twin shores to the southeast. They crave the tasty reef fish that can be found on the east and west side of the isles. Take this net and gather enough fish. At least a dozen. Maybe more to lure a bull across the strait to a reef cow. Stay warm. Okay, well, looks like we ruined... Uh, <laughs> the ecology... kind of funny. Well, we did it for a good... It was for a good cause. You know, now the pirates are no longer attacking. We probably didn't even have to do that quest. Let's be honest. But if you do it, then yeah, there's a, there's a follow-up. I didn't know that. I wonder how they found out that we used his blubber for soap. Is this what we need to do? Fight a great reef shark? Oh, we gotta use a net. Oh, there's a school of tasty fish right here. This is this a fishing quest? Might be. Is 
Does this work? Okay, there we go. We got another couple here. Never done this quest. I think it's a da yeah, it's a daily. Reef bowl led to reef cow. Toss tasty reef fish at a reef bowl to lead it to a reef cow. Once you have helped the two to find true love, return to Ananuniac. So we have to find a reef bull and a reef cow. That's a reef shark. Are these the reef ones? These are sharks. I wonder if any if we get anything for throwing that. We can get some more fish here though. I cast in our net. Oh what the heck is that? Looks like we got a great reef shark. Can I throw a fish at him? That doesn't work. I'm not too sure where we're going to find these other... These reef bowls and reef cows. <laughs> it's too bad we can't get up here to be able to fly. I think we went a little too far there. They're kind of tough to find. Unless, like, it's the sharks. Throw out a reef bowl. Or attracted reef... Reef bowl to get to follow you for a short time. The thing is, we gotta find another one. Like, a reef... A reef cow. <laughs> Not too sure where we're going to find one of those. There's like nothing in the water at all. Can I mount up in the water? No, you can't do that in Wrath of Lich King. I believe you can do that in in retail. You can just mount up in the water. As long as you're above the water, right? Alright, well, we'll just fly around. And hopefully we can find them. We'll do like a little lap here. Supposedly this is where they all are. Like maybe right in this area here. Yeah, there's the reef bulls. Where's the reef cows? I assume the cows are on the other side. Okay. Here we go, guys. Here's our bull. Let's bring him on over. Well, how much fish you need? Let's go. Get going. Wow, you really gotta feed him, eh? I don't think he's gonna make it. Come on, man. Come on, come see a cow. Come on, you're right here. Oh, damn. We're one fish off. 
I clearly didn't pick the right bull. No wonder they have a tough time finding food. This place is full of orcas and sharks. I should put it on uh, tracking fish. Because that would make this a little bit easier. Oh, what the heck? He just got lead? Okay, we'll take it. Alright, so let's uh, hearth back. It looks like it worked. I guess the cow came on over and said hi to him. <laughs> and there's uh, a manta ray school, so we're getting close to the school anyways. Alright, so let's turn this in. We'll see what we get. It seems to be a fishing daily, I, I would assume. Your company... Is welcome. This is good news. No, now more bulls will swim across the strait to mate with the cow. Soon there will be plenty of new reef pups on the isles. Thank you, Undead. Whatever you might have done in the past, know that you have helped the Kamigawa's future. We'll have to keep up the good work if we're going to see to it that their numbers are replenished. Please come back again tomorrow so that we can help another couple find each other. Visit again. By daily quest complete. Undead, word just came off the boat from Malaki Harbor. Something very bad happened over there this morning. You've been very helpful to us here. Would you consider using the boat to travel to the Great Dragon Blight? By the sound of things, Elder Konani would could certainly use your assistance. Alright, guys. There we go. Is there something you desire? Visit again when you can. Pretty cool boat. I like how it has like a vendor on it. You can repair your, your coin gear. Is valuable, even out here. They actually have these in uh in Dragonflight, like these boats, these tortoise boats, or whatever you want to call them. <laughs> Same thing, got the bait to, uh, to steer it. But one thing they don't have is this vendor. They don't have a vendor on it. One thing I noticed. I think that's one of the coolest parts of the boat. Most, like, zeppelins and ships don't really have a vendor for you to, you know, trade with. I wonder if we can get on the front here. I don't want to jump in the water and then we're stuck. <laughs> that would kind of suck. This guy looks kind of cool. Getting a little darker over here in Dragon Blight. It's pretty fast. I'd say it's as fast as like a 280 flight speed mount. Around the same speed. It's faster than our mount. Our current flying mount, I think. There is new Hearth Glen. I always mix this place up with new Agamont. Hmm. 
And this is going to be the new zone, guys. I want to try to get as many quests done in this zone as I can. I never really did many, many quests in this zone. I did a decent amount, but not all of them. Right, so here we are, Moaki Harbor. Then there's another boat that brings us to another Tuscar village. And I believe that one is in Borean Tundra. Here, we'll track minerals again. All right, so here he is. Elder Konani. The land is in great upheaval. The Dark Ones rides forth again with his sand lane. The dragons fight in their great nexus war, and the Vikrul are reawakened. Your people sail north on your wooden ships to fight them and one another, and we, Kaluak, are caught in the middle. And now some great evil has been done, so that the land explodes with the magical power of the world. We must find a safe haven where we will have a, have a chance to survive. These two ambassadors make my head hurt. Perhaps you can help my people, Undead. Stay warm. What's that you say, Undead? A Nuniac sent you? Good, good. There's much to do. We can use all of the help that we can get. Well, we should go with here. The back piece isn't bad. These pants, maybe? The yeah, pants are pretty good. Lose a lot of intellect, though. I guess we'll take the pants. Travel the wastes with care. Alright, so it looks like we got the Horde and the Alliance arguing here. Trying to, to you know, gain, I guess, influence over Elder Kanani. But yeah, guys, this is going to be the end of today's episode. Next episode, we will see what's going on here at Moaki Harbor. But as always, thanks for watching. Keep your heads up. Later.